Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you a few trades that were posted on Friday, 14th of July 2023. These trades here were shared by AA who's trading Nasdaq CFD. As you see from the macro chart here, the price was in uptrend, but it broke this level and entered a complex sideway pullbacks here. And this downward move was seen in the structural chart as a downtrend. So using a smaller 10 second trading chart, he identified multiple area of pullbacks and entered two positions here, sell short and manage and exit them with exit strategy number one with profit and the result is shown here. So thank you AA for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by MG who's trading Dow Jones Industrial Average in form of CFD. As you see the macro chart is in uptrend and we see that in also a structural chart here that the price is going up and there was an area of pullback here. So using a smaller 20 second trading chart, he identified area of pullbacks and entered in this area based on algo one to five and managed this trade with profit using exit strategy number one. And the result of these trades are shown here. So thank you MG for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those that I have taken during the New York market session and the video with detailed explanation was sent to students yesterday. So I'm gonna replay the video here for you. Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you the trades that I have taken today on Friday, 14th of July, 2023. These trades were taken on the NASDAQ and Dow Jones and also S&P 500 futures. If we look at the macro charts, we see that the market was bullish and the price during the global session was fluctuating around the previous day close on all minis and pre-market we had a bullish move uh, due to the news and then during New York market session uh, when it opened it started to go up immediately on Nasdaq and also S&P 500 Dow Jones was in sideways I took this channel of sideway on Dow Jones which is here uh, between 9.30 to 10 this range here on the YM was taken using setup B and then when the buyers came back on NASDAQ around 10.50 here we see this candle on the NASDAQ which is going up I took long position here we see runner and close to the end of market also I took some long position on S&P 500 we see this bullish move of these three candles here that is shown on S&P then when the price crashed and reached this point of control again I took long position around 3 o'clock and on these two candles here that is going up so these signals were copied by copy trader to multiple Apex Trader funds accounts on today's choppy trend uh, we had a profit factor is still positive 1.29 and the win rate was about 63% on these long positions and average win to loss ratio was 0.75 the largest winning trade was 770 and the largest losing trade was 569 so I hope this trade taken by the PAN system is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions have a wonderful day and also weekend